it's Eileen, your independent sissy consultant and girl to a day. Grab a drink, grab your snack, because we are here to chat about all the scented warmers of the month for um, the year 2022. Can you guys believe that? 2022 is almost over. It's gone. A year. Done. In the books, girl. Book it out. Do what you gotta do. 2023 is coming, and I'm excited for a lot of personal reasons why I'm excited, but I'm also excited for Sensi. Sensi always comes out with wonderful, amazing things that, girl, they hit you in your pocketbook. So, let's get into it. We're gonna start off. I saved all my Scent and Warmers um, of the Month flyers and a bar each. So, for this, when I did this last year, I haven't seen anybody else do it, so I was like, you know, I think that'll be pretty cool. Plus, when I save all the bars of the year, I still have one more bar to warm through if I like it, if I don't like it, whatever. So let's get into it. <laughs> Scent and Warmer of the Month only sticks around till it sells out or about six months after its release date. Um, Scent and Warmer of the Month um, changes every month with Scentsy and it's offered at 10%. After that month is over that the warmer and the bar is being featured, then it goes to normal price. So that's what you probably have to look forward to 2023. So first up, January was Better Together. And this was a beautiful glass warmer. It was, um, I think I'm trying to do it for like Valentine's Day, get everybody uh, ahead. And it was absolutely gorgeous. Um, so usually I keep all the warmers of the month. And girl, I didn't because my brother ordered this and then I forgot to order it for him. And then I forgot. So then I gave him mine. So he just bought mine. But the scent of the month, that's what we're really here for, was um, Sun Ripened Berry. A refreshing scoop of orange sherbet sprinkled with sun ripened berries and strawberry sugar. And Sensi put this in the fruity, cate fruity category. I love this. This was amazing. I kept on coming back in our clearance section throughout the year and uh, I kept on buying it. Then I kept on warming it. Then I kept on buying it. Oh, and I kept on warming it. I tried to put this in my club and when I recognized I didn't, I said, oh, I better go put that in my club. And then it's gone. So it is what it is. I think this is club worthy. I wish it would come back for the catalog. I don't think it's going to come back because it was in Clarence. I don't think people loved it as much as I did. I loved mixing this with sea salt and avocado, one of my absolute faves. So I thought that was extremely club worthy. For February, we got the blue a gate, I believe it was called. We got a full size glass warmer and a uh, mini warmer combo. And I believe we did, we get both of these. On um, this, I didn't see people really like it, to be honest with you. I didn't, I didn't think it hit pretty big. It was beautiful blue. In fact, I wanna say, I don't even know if I have this. I didn't put it out. I don't know if I sold it, girl. I don't remember what I did. Um, but it's, it was, I mean, it's beautiful if you love blue. I mean, it's the same, Scentsy does have kind of the same signature design. It's the same exact um, glass warmer as this. They're the same shape. They, they kind of keep to the same things, um, which is great for if you break your dishes or whatever, if it's the same that the you can order the same dish and it can fit multiple warmers. But really, really beautiful if you love that kind of um, aesthetic in your home. But the real hitter here for me was Sunburst Bamboo. This is amazing. This is, since he put this in the fresh category, Lush Sunburst Bamboo Crisp Cucumber under a sheer canopy of peony offer a tranquil escape. And I love this. I put this in my club right away. I'm still in my club. It's beautiful. It smells like a spa. We have out here in California, it's called Glen Ivy and it's a spa. You Like all day you're in sulfur waters and pools and you're doing like, you're in and out of a hot and cold pool. I don't do that. I don't do the cold. No way. But this is so pretty. This smells like when you're going to go get a massage and they just have all this tranquil bamboo everywhere. It's just, oh, it's beautiful. It is a good performer for me, but I only use it to meditate. Oh my God, girl, I didn't tell you. This was a great performer. This is a boomer. This was like a seven out of 10. It went for days. I, I, girl, I need to do that. This, it's going to be lighter. 
It's still a good performer to me. It's not that strong, but I only use it to meditate. So, I mean, a lot of people um, throughout the year, they've commented on this because I love it so much. They say that it's very light. Well, if you're trying to put it in a room filling or if you're trying to put it in the bathroom, yeah, it's going to be light. It's made, meant to be like a spa. It's not supposed to be boom in your face. And I use it for meditation. So for me, this was club worthy. This is in my club because I love it that much. Up next is April, March. I was thinking April because I saw the Easter Bunny girl. This is March. We got this cute little tin Easter gnome. I kept him, I love him. He's super, super cute. This is when Scentsy really, really started um, implementing in their regular warmers, not just seasonal warmers, that these lids are open from the back so we can get all of our scent, which I do love that. The little Easter Bunny came in time. I wanna say he sold out. I remember he was popular, he did. He sold out, really, really cute. I believe he had like some, something in the back to shine because he didn't shine forward, but I think he had like, like little cutouts on the back. Super, super cute. And the scent of the month for March was Hey Tiger Lily. Wild Tiger Lily. Perks up sugar, mandarin, luscious jasmine, and for on a bright and beautiful sunny day. This is floral. It was too floral for me. I didn't like it. <laughs> and I love floral. Oh, it was, yes, it's still, it's so, um, woo, girl. Um, it's powder floral. But it has orange, and I kind of like the orange. I will not be warm with it. I do know a couple of my really, really good customers and friends that do. So somebody will, the bottom smells more orange. But girl, this is like powdered flowers and orange and it just didn't work for me. But I mean, since it does beautiful packaging, beautiful coloring, I know that doesn't matter to some people. Like it doesn't matter to me just because it's bright and beautiful orange doesn't mean that I'm gonna warm it, but it's beautiful though. I mean, I do appreciate that. And I do love the warmer and the warmer is going out for Easter in 2023, girl. But they come out with so much stuff for every collection that it's kind of hard. And that's why I think I have so many warmers because I do, I end up loving all the warmers, except for this warmer. I did not like April's warmer of the month at all. Um, this is the, oh my God, what was this called? I'll tell you what this is called because I did not like it. Desert Bloom. So this looks like a half artichoke. And Scentsy does have a lot of the beautiful, like desert mocking plants as warmers. If you don't have a green thumb, you know, you can always get a nice Scentsy warmer and you don't have to water and you don't have to worry about anything. This number one was ugly. I did not like it at all. In fact, I think I still have it um, somewhere like in my closet. And the price for this little tiny warmer that barely fit in your hand, okay? Girl, they were charging you $49.50. No, I said it then and I said it now. Stick by my word, it's not worth it. It wasn't even worth it when they put it like 30% off. Girl, this is a little warmer. Okay, 25 bucks, all right? That's my opinion, is what it is. I didn't put this out to warm. I didn't like it. I didn't want to sell it to my customers. I said, if you really, really like it and you have to have it, yes, I'll order it for you, but save your taco money, okay? That's what you need to do. But the scent of the month was absolutely beautiful. The scent of the month was Ruby Nectarine. Juicy Nectarine and Ruby Apple blended with pear blossom for a fresh spin on fruity. Yes, this is in my club. This is in like my quarterly club. Oh, this mix so perfect and a little bit better with sea salt and avocado than uh, sun ripened berry. So this kind of took the place of sun ripened berry and I absolutely love it. It is a boomer. It is an eight and a half out of 10 girl. This is open concept worthy. It's wonderful. Nobody complains. It's fresh and fruity and it's bright and I love it. So that was for April. So April had a really good scent of the month and girl, that was a boof warmer. Let's just be real. It was a boof warmer. Was not worth it. Unless you're into collecting the succulents and you had to have it at a $50 price, basically. Not worth it to me. Um, 
what are we in? May, girl, May's warmer of the month was the bubbled iridescent and this actually made it in the catalog for this year. Yeah, this made it in the catalog. It was really, really popular. I remember doing a whole special on it for my customers and I got so many people. It's an absolutely beautiful, stunning warmer, right? really bright I must curse right now because it is bright girl it is bright it is in your face this is this is very very one of those look at me I'm here warmer which girl I love because that's what I'm all about beautiful but when it's off it's just like this and it's nothing uh, special when it's off but when it's on girl it's beautiful but it's in your face so if you have it in your living room and you're trying to like have like movie night Girl, it's gonna be right here so you gotta turn it off okay that's just what it is if you need a night light in your room perfect girl okay because it is super super bright girl that one scent just got my nose going oh my gosh and the scent of the month that month girl, it's getting here. How can I open this up? was pink lemon water I was all for this and girl this beautiful pink I was all for oh girl look it I was, I was probably making samples knowing me. You got rose water infused with refreshing lemon and a spoonful of sugar, and this is in the citrus section. I was excited for this because when I remember seeing this on the end of the month live, I remember them saying, it's not that much rose, it's really pretty refreshing, the lemon, and girl, I'm all about lemons, okay? And it smells like lemon, and it smells citrusy, and then when you put it on, the rose comes out. And nobody in my house likes rose. It smells like viejitas, which means old ladies. Like those old ladies that are still good. They're, they're still, you know, girl, they, 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 not in their prime, but they're not wilted yet, okay? And they put on all this perfume because, girl, their hair's done and all that. And they're just going grocery store, okay? That's where they're going. But they smell like roses. And it's just strong and it's invasive and you're just like girl you smell good but the minute coming because girl that that barrier of your scent that's this with lemon it's a lot of rose on warm so it wasn't my cup of tea so this warmer is absolutely beautiful it's in the catalog it's something you can get now and it's it's a it's a good warmer it's a good performer girl but you gotta like bright okay you gotta like bright you gotta remember that Oh, and when I did warm this, this was strong. So this was a good one if you like strong. It's just not my cup of tea. Okay, we got June. June, I heard people going crazy for the warmer. I heard bad things about the warmer. I heard everything. I heard everything in between. We got the cute camper. Okay, the USA camper. Now, here in America, some people are all for this. Some people are like, no, okay. Girl, this is where I stand on it, okay? It's just me. I liked it. I really did. I thought it was cute. I was hoping Sensi is going to do like a camper series because we have our Christmas camper and now we have a, um, a USA festive patriotic camper, okay? I am not like radical patriotic but I am patriotic do I decorate my house with red white and blue no because that's not my aesthetic in my house but I didn't mind having this camper girl okay I didn't and I put it in my kitchen and I put a blue bulb in it and it was really really cute and I didn't see anything wrong with it now some people loved it some people were like ah, F America okay that, that's you I'm not I'm not coming here for you but you could change the colors in here and you could do all kinds of stuff and i want to say it sold out if i didn't remember i think it did sell out for um uh fourth of july they were that, that's what they were doing it was, it was really beautiful you guys if you have the christmas camper you know it's a good performer you know this is going to be a good performer there's no surprises okay you know what you're getting and i'm hoping since he will do more campers in more different themes and the Scent of the month that month was a good one, girl. It was a good one. It is so club worthy. This is red, white, and berry pie. A sweet slice of ripened cherry red raspberries baked with vanilla. This is in the bakery section. This is going to blow you out of the house. This is like a nine, okay? It's strong. It's a good, long, 
Oh my God, performer, you smell the cherry. So everybody was comparing this to maraschino cherry. No, maraschino sugar cookie. They're kind of similar. This one um, has more of that bakery vanilla note that I did not smell before until I compared them both. And maraschino sugar cookie is more toned down to the sugar cookie that we know and everybody loves. I don't like sugar cookie, it's too soft for me. So it's more cherry, more sweet. This has that vanilla in it and you can smell it. Now, is it totally like you could smell the crust? No, but it, I want the filling, girl. When I like pie, I love filling. This was beautiful. This is club worthy. I mean, I didn't put this in my club because I still have a few bars of it. And oh, this is great and bakery and it's wonderful. And I believe a lot of people love this too. I know this got really, really good reviews. So Land of the Liberty trailer and it was red, white, and berry pie. I thought this was a good month to buy, in my opinion. Now we have July which I was, when I was talking about it, I remember back in July, people were over it. People were over succulents. So it is what it is. We have Wild Desert, that was our warmer, and it was absolutely cute. You can decorate um, your little warmers. I think Scentsy was still going for the desert name. I was getting a lot of feedback from people. They're over it. They're over, they're over the, succulents people are over it I don't know um, I didn't keep mine mine ended up getting sold because people do do love succulents girl but this month this was a good one this one's in my club too I think this is in my quarterly we have a desert tropics this is in the fruity category bright tropical berries dragon fruit lush mango pineapple comes alive in the desert rain and this goes amazing with sea salt and avocado amazing and alternate warmers oh my god i love this more than ruby nectarine oh this is so fruity so juicy you get the little bit of you know pineapple a little bit of mango and it, it is it's bright and this is a great performer this is an eight out of ten this is open concept worthy this is strong long this was a good one I ended up loving the scent. It's in my club. August. We did not get a warmer of the month. They had some kind of uh, manufacturing issue. Don't know, girl. Don't work at home office. Don't know the ins and outs. But we got a scent of the month, which I'll tell you right now. Girl. They gave us these papers. And they gave us, like... Eight or nine bars. I don't remember. Girl. Yeah. And I was a little disappointed. Disappointed. I'm an August baby. I wanted a warmer of the month and see what was in my month. And I didn't get it. I couldn't even tell you, girl, what it was because we got nothing. So, scent of the month is Glacier Water. Glacier water waters rush into mountain streams, peacefully flowing over bright bergamot aquatic lavender and driftwood and they put this in the fresh category this was a big disappointment because this is men's cologne this isn't fresh like ocean this isn't aquatic um like by the sea this is straight up men's cologne if you want a man smell if you're missing your man and you need some man smells girl right here didn't warm it, didn't care to warm it. I don't like the man smell. I got my own man, he smells already in here, so I don't need man smells. But that was, I didn't even warm it, girl. Just being honest, okay? That, that's all I can be, that's all I can do. So, September, warmer and scent of the month. Bangers, both bangers. Oh, look at girl. See, none, none offered for August, right? Here's Glacier Water, because on the back of our little pamphlets, it shows you what we've had before in the past. And this one, hands down, is the cutest one of the whole year. He's, well, January is cute. I love January. But this one did it. Girl, it was Frankie. Well, that's what I named mine. Frankie came, girl, he hit the streets. He came to my house. He was... He was living it up since I had him out since um, August, because if this is September's, I got it in August. Love me some Frankie, and he was absolutely adorable. Oh, I loved him. And that month, 
was Gimme Candy Girl. Gimme Candy came out. It's a sweet confection of caramelized sugar, golden honey, and sweet butter cream. Makes for the ultimate sugar rush. They put this in the bakery section. Girl, I all love candy corn. I was afraid this was gonna smell like candy corn because I'm not a big candy corn person, but girl, no. This is all sugar. This is so coinly sweet and strong, girl. It's like a nine, 10, this will blow you out the house. Yep. And it gets a little butterscotch, just a tiny bit. You wanna tone this down? Put sugar cookie in it. You wanna tone it down? You wanna make it even more sweet? Put a uh, mix of uh, vanilla bean buttercream with it. It was really good. Super sweet, super strong, super long, and I know a lot of people ended up really, really liking this. I think we were all done with like summer by the time September comes. I know here I am. I'm like, give me all the pumpkin, give me all the candy, give me all the everything, have summer go away, but then summer stays, you know, just is what it is. But amazing. This was a good time to buy. I did a personal special on him too because my people loved him. I loved him. Super cute. Can't wait for him to come back out. Okay. Told you that was long and strong. Yep, that's what, what we're at. We are at now, girl, if I said that was September, girl, this is October. October was a good month too. October was wonderful to buy. We got the Tiger Eye Pumpkin and I did keep this one as well for myself. Absolutely beautiful. It's ugly turned off, because that's what it is, what it is, okay? It's just absolutely like, girl, oh, blah, okay, it is. When you turn it on, it comes alive. It's beautiful. I was loving this, um, the lid, how they did like the wiring. It's not wire, but it's like a metal outline of a lid instead of um, concealing our scent. Absolutely beautiful. And then Sensi decided to knock it out of the park, okay, and give us warm pumpkin drizzle. <laughs> this is amazing. This was amazing. Warm pumpkin drizzle is warm clothes. Comfort Cozy Pumpkin with a drizzle of sweet maple, and this is in the bakery section. Yes, yes, and yes. I love this. This is such good pumpkin, and I don't smell clove, but if it is, it's there. But it has a little bit of the maple, which is beautiful. Great performer, eight out of 10. Sensi knocked it out with this. This was this is warm comfort. I'm still warming some of these. I love these. And like I said, I have one more bar of each of the whole year to, to warm through, even if I don't like them. It's beautiful. This was a good month to buy. So, more recent is November. Oh my God, November, yeah, November. Was our cute little element snowman, you guys. He's so cute. He's in my bathroom. I love him. Absolutely cute. I love this little snowman. Um, I believe when I said he's like a 12 watt warmer, if I'm not mistaken. Girl, don't quote me because I don't remember. They don't give us the wattage on here, which I wish they would. Um, Sensi, I know you guys watch me. Um, yeah, you guys should start putting the wattages on here. It makes it easier uh, for us. It really does. I want to say he was like a 12 watt element warmer. So, in November, since they had to bring a pine, of course they did, right? So, we have a uh, sweet orange and evergreen. Festive fresh cut evergreens decked with sweet orange and cedar wood invite you to a winter's night. And this is in the woods category. Now, I cannot be mad, okay? I just told you all these other ones. We've been like fruity, we've been fresh, and we've been bakery. Well, now they had to do a wood. Okay, it is what it is. I don't like it. Okay, I didn't warm it. Um, I sent most of my bars uh, to my girl Nisi. If y'all haven't checked out Nisi, she has a channel here. Um, I will have my husband link her channel down below. She's wonderful. Um, Nisi loves pine, and when she told me she loved pine, girl, I sent her all this stuff. I was like, I don't like it. Oh, just pine. If you like pine, I'm pretty sure this was a great performer. If y'all like this and y'all know what it, um, how it performed, put it down in the comments, please. That helps out a lot of people, especially when I don't want to warm these because, ugh, awful. Great warmer. If you like pine, it was for you. I just, I enjoyed the warmer. And last but not least is this month's scented warmer of the month, which Oh, you guys, I love this warmer. I kept it for myself. It is, um, what is it called? Winter Retreat. In fact, it's here in my room. It's beautiful. It is a good glow, girl. So this is not like bam in your face, but it's 
really, really prominent. So if you need light, um, it's great. Again, if you're going to have a movie night and you want it dark, you should turn the warmer off. That's just what it is. And this month we have cinnamon pine cones. A warm, sparkling scent of cinnamon pine cones adorn classic fir balsam branches, classic hit, hint of sweet cinnamon stick. This is also woods. So again, I'm not going to complain two months out of the year we get woods. Do I like this? Absolutely not. I did, um, at, I didn't accidentally, I warmed it thinking it was going to smell along the lines of welcome home because that's what it does smell like on cold. On cold, this doesn't bother me. On cold, this smells again like a craft store. It doesn't smell like this, but on warm, all the pine comes out, no cinnamon. It is strictly pine. It was strong hair in my room, and I turned it off and I said, no, get the F out of here. So if you love pine, this is again for you. This winter retreat is absolutely gorgeous and I think it's more of a winter warmer than a Christmas warmer but it can do for both so I plan to keep out this little lantern and again since he is since he's hitting it with these lids that are open so that we can enjoy our fragrance so I absolutely did love this I think this is beautiful I think it's great to pick up it is on sale right now you can find it on my website if you like pine this is it girl and just so you guys know sometimes these stick around like I said for six months if you like some of them they're probably still on the website girl you know you can uh, pack a six pack for 30 bucks or pack a three pack for 17 and you can mix and match your scents if you liked any of these and as always, Sensi fam, I love to hear your comments down below. What warmers did you guys get throughout the year? What was your favorite scents out of the year scent? What made it in your club? Let a girl know down below. And as always, your comments do help someone else that is trying to figure out maybe what they want, what they're trying to figure out with Sensi. I think 2022 was a great year for scent and warmer of the month. Not that many misses. And I think there was a lot of great hits. And I cannot wait for 2022. Three. So, as always, Sensi Fam, after you let me know down below, hit your like, your subscribe, and your notification bells. And if you guys still want to hang around after all that, you still want to hang out here with me, there is always a video here. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, Sensi Fam.